It is a theme song. Thanks. Thank you, Gloria. Finally, we will, we will hear from the Citrine and the Fernando from Fortnite 3D. Yeah. Amazing for me. 
And I remember when my dad encouraged, or encouraged me to ride my bicycle along. I really miss my childhood because in that time I learned from my parents that how to get along with people is important to be successful in my life. Time flies and we can't modify it. So what can we do? Maybe the good answer for it can be carpe diem from Latin. In other words, enjoy life because life is short. I confess that it sounded a little strange for me when I was a child. But believe me, because I know how much it's true since now I'm 44. <laughs> Even though my childhood feels like something that happened yesterday. I have no idea about how many people I have met since I was encouraged by my parents to face life. However, I am sure that some of them made the difference for me. And it means that many of you who are celebrating tonight helped me to become a better person. Thank you. At first, I thought that to learn the English as a second language would be my biggest challenge. However, since I arrived here, I have seen that living with people from different countries is much more challenging because it is not an easy task living in unity within the diversity that exists, that exists here. Like my dad who encouraged me, teachers who are now my friends push me through the magnificent world of second language, where I found more than just words in English. Working on the charity project, I learned more about the importance of human lives. So, thanks, Jerry. Because you gave us the great opportunity to fight against poverty in Africa. It's impossible to forget teachers as Cal, Linda, Erin, and Jerry, because they have been a beautiful inspiration, motivating us to walk in the right way of learning. So, be sure I will keep their classes in the best and memorable moments that I had studying at the Ubik. In the beginning of my speech, I told you about my childhood when my dad encouraged me to take my first step. Well, little has changed since I was a child, because now I, nowadays I continue walking toward my challenges, overcoming my own limits every day. For this reason, I thank my parents, family, and girlfriend to whom I dedicate this achievement. As the poet said, I am the captain of my destiny. So there is no one who is able to threaten or stop me because Nietzsche, Nietzsche's philosophy of what does not kill me makes me stronger is my motto. It's my flag. <laughs> Finally, I thank God who guided me by this awesome way whereby I reaffirmed my clear conviction that we are infinitely more than simple animals since we have intelligence and feelings enough to comprehend that something can be difficult but perfectly possible when we keep our faith active. Thank you so much. <laughs>